What is up, guys? Welcome on back to TK's Garage. And yeah, I look like I aged a lot. I have, man. This, uh, <clears throat> I ain't been doing great. But I told y'all I was going to be gone for a little bit, and I would <clears throat> try to get in as much as I could. And uh, this was a viewer-requested video you guys asked about. You know, how could you get a Hellcat for like 50% off of retail? And we're going to talk a little bit about that today. But before we do, I got to get into the sponsor of today's video. That's right, it's Black Rifle Coffee. I got the new Rich Mocha on deck. Love this, you know, I like I like my uh, dark coffee as well as uh, other things. Mm. God, I love that. Triple shot of espresso, 300 milligrams. Ding! Uh, go check them out. You can go get it at BlackRifleCoffee.com. Select retailers have it, or if you're on a military installation, whether you're on base, post, or station somewhere, um, you can find it at your uh, shop at or at your commissary or PX. One of those will have it, or PX. I'm sorry. With that said, uh, let's go ahead and, and get into the video. All right, we are in here. Let me try to move myself like somewhere where I'm not in the way of y'all seeing stuff. All right, so what we're going to get into now is we're going to look at some of the different hell. I need to search for Hellcats. We're on the IAA site right now. We're actually in the app. And, um, you know, we're not going to look at Canada because importing. Ugh. But look, here's a 2017 Dodge Charger SRT Hellcat. Now, the reason why it's right now there's so many hellcats that are flooded in the market in the salvage market is because a ton of them were stolen before they could ever be sold they were being stolen in detroit um and then you know moved to like texas and florida and other places and they changed the vins with like sxts or other cars and um you know eventually they get caught and then they get run through the auction a lot of them have absolutely i mean they've been dogged but they have nothing wrong physically with the cars. It's just that they've been VIN swapped. So now it means like it'll have a new VIN number from the state. But it, it if it's just for you, if it's not something you want to keep because it's going to be a collector's car and you're just going to drive it and enjoy having a Hellcat, this is the way to go. Here's a 17 Charger SRT Hellcat. Oh, no longer available for bidding. That means it just sold today at 10.30. Wow. Yeah, this one took a oof, nice little bang to the rear quarter and that um, rear back door. But you know what? That possibly could be fixed. That could possibly be fixed. Somebody probably got a good good price on that too. We got another one here, a 2016. This one sold today. So many of them run through, guys. But the the purpose of me showing you guys these, I want to find some that haven't been sold yet. Um, here we go. All right, current bid, 22500 They don't have a buy it now, all right? This one is in North Carolina, so shout out to all my Carolina people, specifically in Greensboro. Let's look at the HD video. Now, you're going to have to turn your phone. Oh, good, it didn't make me turn the phone. I like that. All right, awesome. <clears throat> all right, let's zoom in on the damage here. So that rear quarter is hit. Now, the problem with the Challenger is everything, so on the pillar that goes up by the window, it's all one piece. So that whole piece comes along the roof line to the back and goes right up to the door, but that's all one piece. That car could be reskinned because I'm not seeing any structural damage under it. It looks like reskinning it, maybe cutting this crap off of the crash bar, tail lights, some plastics definitely could be fixed 100 percent 100 percent could be repaired from what i'm seeing right now and it's a manual oh man and it's a manual stop it only thirty-seven thousand miles with the red key a lot of these <clears throat> that you see that run through either copart or iaa they won't even have the damn red keys the seats look good 
I'm going to be honest with you guys. This right here does not look like a bad deal. Wow, look at that blower, the whole nine. Red key on deck. And I'm sorry if the uh, app is opening slowly, but there's not much I can do about it in the HD mode because uh, I'm actually out here at, at Nellis, Nellis Air Force Base, and they're not known for having the best uh, wireless service, especially when they're doing, they're doing like live fire exercise, like they're dropping bombs and shit, so... When that happens, the networks go nuts. But look, the pre bit it's at 225,500. Huh. For a 15. So that's the first year, the very first year, and it's only got 37,000 miles. This thing was not driven a lot at all. When you think about that, I mean, that, wow, that's a different one. That's a 19. That one smashed. But, huh. Cash value, they say it's worth forty-nine. Repair cost is about eighteen thousand. Oh, it was already rebuilt once before. See that the rebuilt brand, and it's a salvage title now. So you'd have to get it rebuilt again. Uh, I mean, it's it's definitely possible. But you know what I'm gonna do with this one? <laughs> Add that to my watch list. No, come on, internet, cooperate with me. All right, that one is smashed. We really don't care about that. Here's one. Here's a twenty. Look at this prime example. Buy it now. Price is thirty six thousand dollars. This by itself. Is exactly what I'm talking about. Thirty-six thousand dollars, right here. Four thousand eight hundred miles on it. What is the damage? It clearly runs. Let's see if it'll open the video or if my internet sucks too bad. Okay, hold on. So it runs, it runs, uh, airbags are deployed, front end, it's a salvage title from Nevada, total loss, I don't get it, I don't understand why that's a total loss, I'm looking at the same thing that you guys are, right, I, like I'm looking in the front, I do see where like some of the stuff in the front doesn't line up, I see that. Oh, I know what this is. See, this is one of the things you have to watch out for when you bid, bid on cars like this. <coughs> somebody bought this car. Somebody bought this car previously. And they, uh, at the auction. That's why it's got the food stamp tires and rims on it. Not even the real SRT wheels or nothing on it. Yeah, see how they come way far in? So... Somebody like repurposed that front fascia and like reconnected it. It's probably held together with zip ties and shit. And there's probably a lot of damage under that front of that car. Like, look, let me go to HD view. We're going to zoom in. I bet you I see running paint. That's what it looks like right there. <coughs> Sorry, guys. My lungs are really hurting today. Yeah, look, look, look. Can you see the crinkle in the front fender right there? Like they bent it back out. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. So this one's been doctored. I hate to see I hate to see that. You know, I really do, but you know, it happens unfortunately in this business. It's not great, you know. But what are you gonna do? 36 grand. I mean just the engine, just a powertrain. I mean you could fix it. Buy it, pull the powertrain out, use the other parts, the wide body kit and stuff on it, and put it on another Challenger. I don't know. So there's that. Let's see. A Durango Hellcat. Title is not yet available. See, now, 
this is another thing that they do is they do, do this is new. This is a new thing where dealers are now selling cars through IAA. And you can see it. The buy it now price is $129,000. And I can't believe that they're letting Earth Motor Cars advertise on their app. That's new. I'm going to have to hit IAA up about that and find out if that's legit or not. Here's a 2021 SRT Hellcat Widebody. No photos available, huh? Nope. Here's a 2019. See, this is the one thing I was hoping wasn't going to happen, but it looks like it is, man. So now dealers are, because of the success of IAA and Copart, now you're going to have dealers flooding the apps. Like, no, man. No, this is not the move, man. Oh, here's an 18 SRT Hellcat. That's a theft. Ooh, ouch. A little bit of a spank to the back there. Tail lights are done. That rear quarter is done. Interior looks good. It could be fixed. It definitely could be fixed. Never mind. <laughs> I'm done. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, there's no engine. There's nothing, nothing left of the car. Wow. Wow. Here's an 18 SRT Hellcat. The whole side of that's destroyed, though. That really wouldn't be worth much, to be honest with you. I'm not going to spend time on that one. 17. Run and drive. Look at them Raptors. The Raptors are in the air. I don't know why the photos aren't loading, but whatever. But you guys get the gist. I didn't want to make this a super long video. I wanted to show you guys that these vehicles are available. Um, and I wanted to show you guys that you can get them at well, well more than 50% less of retail. And not always with a salvage title. Sometimes... They'll still have a clean title. So definitely check it out. You can check them out at IAA. I. IAAI.com. Um, insurance auto auctions. Um, and what I'll do later this week is we'll take a look at some of the other stuff that's available. Uh, maybe with uh, Copart and then Mannheim and a couple other places. So you guys get an idea of where to get these Hellcats for cheap. Um, if you got your own funding, like if you went to like a, a credit union or something... You can literally take the VIN number from these, especially if they're clean, and you can get a loan for it. That'll let you be able to bid and buy the car. So, um, you know, a little bit of insight, a little bit of uh, how that works. I am fighting through the illness stuff, guys. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm doing the best I can do. But um, let's go ahead and get out of here. We'll wrap up. Oh, uh, all right, guys. <laughs> One of the... Uh, force protection guys just came up to the car and they're like are you okay sir yeah i'm good evidently i guess they've had a, a few people uh off themselves in their cars out here this week that's not happening over here i'm sorry um uh, man mm. made a shout out to the sponsor of today's video black rifle coffee love this man this is my new favorite uh coffee right here i'm gonna be drinking these like water Mm. God, I love it. If you like today's video and you like what I do, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button if you haven't already um, so you don't miss out on future videos because I'm going to drop different videos. Um, I'm also going to go look at 11 Hellcats that are in inventory um, at uh, Copart, which is also here in Las Vegas. So I'll uh, be doing that video here as soon as I'm physically able to withstand the, the heat i'll probably go out early in the morning one of these days and go get it done for you guys but um the purpose of today's video was to show you guys that you can get these hellcats for less than 50 percent of retail i mean that one hellcat you saw what was it 20 or thirty-two thousand. the other one was at 22 yes it did require some repairs but you could probably be all in on that car for like 30 you know 
thirty grand and you got a you have an SRT Hellcat with low miles, like that's that's absolutely ridiculous. But anyways, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below, and I will catch you guys very soon on the next one. Perfect.